What's up guys, Volusia1969 doing a free for all in the underpass. This is a very special free for all. Uh, you will see why here in just a second. Uh, I'll be using the, uh, the ACR with the red dot with no silencer. Uh, basically, I was just using this gun to just to use it. And look at that. Look at all the green noobs. This was a lobby from heaven. I mean, I have never been in such a nubulous room. Uh, I didn't plan it. Don't know how it happened. Uh, tell you what happened was I uh, got up this morning, came in the living room, the uh, Turned on my system. Um, took a cup of coffee. Then I clicked on free for all and went and used the bathroom to come back out. And I was in a lobby. And with what you just saw, nothing but green, baby. Green horns. And if you don't know what a green horn is, noobs. So this turned out to be a really, really, really fun. Fun game. Um, you know, I was basically going to spend the day with the uh, sniper rifles, but first game of the morning, I said I'll try the ACR. I'm not really a big fan of it. I thought I'd give it a try. Like I said, I thought I'd give it a try, and, you know, like I said, I've never really used it. I've used it just barely enough to get the points, you know, and to get my red dot, and it's not a bad gun. It put me in the mind of the M4 carbine, but with no recoil. This gun has absolutely no recoil at all, so, but, uh, you know, that's pretty much it, man. My strategy was is usually I'm on the other end of the map in a uh, two-story building. Uh, that's usually where I would, you know, pick as my home base. But I said, you know what, I'll try this area over here as my home base. And it worked out pretty good. Um, put a claymore on the right-hand side and a claymore on the left-hand side. And, you know, you pretty much blocked in. So... You know, basically all you got left to do was build your campfire and bring the hot dogs out because the camp is set up. You know, you're this this map is pretty camper friendly, so But uh I did have to do do some moving around since I'm not using a silencer and uh if you are and if you've ever played with noobs before you can tell they're gonna follow that red dot man. If, there's a red dot up on the screen on the map. They're going to go right to it every time. So you got to keep your eyes out because, like I said, you know, they know where I'm at. And that's one of the main reasons why I love using the pave load because, uh, you know, if you're using an unsilenced gun, you know, these, these people will keep coming back for you. And if you're using a chopper gunner, you better find a good place to hide or they will find you. So with the with me using the um with me using the payload, I really don't have to worry about that because I can keep keep playing. And let it get all the kills. So yeah. But uh that's pretty much all I got to say. Uh I did feel I did feel kinda bad for these guys, man, because I just really, really, really went to town, and so after I, after I did get my nuke, I just thought I'd run around and, you know, let them get a few kills off of me, because, you know, I wanted these guys to stay in the room. I would love to play at least a couple more games with them, so if I go a, a flawless game, we're going to back out, so I let, let them get three or four kills, I can remember, but, uh, that's pretty much it guys um finish watching it and you know if you ever get in a lobby like this let them get some kills off of you after you get your nuke 
if you can get a nuke, let them get some kills off of you. That way they will not back out when the game is over. That way you can, uh, you know, at least play a couple more games with them. So, uh, that's pretty much all i got to say. And uh, there's your tactical nuke. And now I'm just going to run around and let them get some kills. Um, thanks for watching. If you look in the top right hand corner, you will see a link to my main page, my main YouTube page. Please go by and check out my other videos. I uh, would appreciate it. Um, and most important, comment, rate, and subscribe if you would. And uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Ready for launch. Ready for launch.